So ladies and gentlemen, we have now arrived at our main event of the evening. And of course it will be for the professional welterweight championship of eternal MMA. Contested over five five minute rounds, introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. He weighed in at 76.7 kilos and trains out of kick ass MMA holding a professional MMA record of seven wins for just two defeats. Ladies and gentlemen, the challenger, Glenn Pettigrew. And his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, he weighed in at 77.2 kilos and trains out of Strappy MMA, also holding a professional record of seven wins for just two defeats. He is the reigning, defending, undisputed, eternal welterweight champion, Jack Della! All right, guys, defend yourself at all times. Listen to my instructions at all times. Touch gloves. Oh, it's time. This main well, event is brought to you by Surge Fitness Matt Simulated Wynn. Altitude Training Studio, or first for WA Health Clubs. We're finally at the main event. I'm Brett Benetti here with Mitchell Tinsley, and we are pumped. Without a doubt. Now, this is the first five round, five minute main event in Perth for Eternal MMA. And there is always a bit of a concern I have with Jack Della. Is there's almost like a first round curse, is regardless of how well he's doing. He does always seem to get caught with something that he has to survive in round one every time. I'm saying he's sitting pretty if he gets to round two. <laughs> That's generally how it works. He, it's not saying he, he loses round one. It's just he gets caught with something. He gets something, caught with something. Something he, he's not happy with. And Pettigrew's got the power to do it. I'll tell you what, though. They both have immense power in each hand. Again, well, uh, again, we re recall in 2017, Della got the job done over Pettigrew in round number one. Like you said, you can't go into this fight with any sort of emotion. You know, that guy beat my brother. That guy's beaten me before. You, you, it's got to be clear. It's got to just be technique. To worry about the execution, not the outcome. Pettigrew will be looking for the opportunity to get that with this one to the mat. But as, as we said, UFC Fight Pass, main event, five five-minute rounds. It's for the Eternal MMA World Fight Championship. There's so much pressure. Both these boys are always so calm. Trust you enjoying our coverage wherever you are watching around the world on UFC Fight Pass. This is Eternal MMA, Australia's most prolific MMA promotion. Nice it's body kick. 51. Great body kick. Nice. Good opening there for Pettigrew. Both boys being super cautious. Heading in, because like we said, one wrong move. Either one can be put to sleep. Pettigrew says it wasn't uh, the real Ken Glenn Pettigrew on the first one, and so far we're seeing it. Both boys just filling each other out. Glenn Pettigrew is looking to use that jab to get himself in. There's a lot of Check. pressure on Della as well. He wants to make a statement. He's got the world watching on UFC Fight Pass. Jack Della being a little bit more cautious than Pettigrew. Pettigrew's really starting to get some shots off. Kind of nice shots there by Pettigrew. Yeah, nice another one. straight right by Pettigrew, that got through. Nice, nice head kick. Jack Della has a tremendous head kick. Believes that he's got more weapons than Pettigrew. That's what he was saying in the lead up to this. But Pettigrew was out of a new gym, you know, new state, new city. Oh, nice shot there by right. Pettigrew. You know, how does that affect him? Is it positive? Is it negative? Zach Diller has his, the stable team, stable show. Nice. One, two, leg kick by Pettigrew. Leg kick straight back by Zach Diller. Look, it is, once again, five five-minute rounds. You're not going to see them come explosive out of the gate. So much on the line. Again, big ramifications for this one. Nice. Ooh. 
Pettigrew catching Jack Diller as he enters. Oh, nice counter there by Pettigrew as Diller came in. Tell you what, Pettigrew is looking much bigger as well. I don't know how his strength and conditioning has been. He's looking in great shape. Shame with Jack. Pettigrew gives him a smile. Both boys really feeling each other out. There's almost a, a bit of a lead slap left hook just to make room for that right hand by Pettigrew. Jack Dell looks to be bleeding a little bit. Yeah, looks he's been caught a couple of times in this first round. It's those straight rights coming straight down. Straight down the pipe. Nice. Nice there by Della. Nice little switch step by Della into the hook. It's what you were saying before, Mitch, Lee, uh, Mitch is that uh, that he oh. can get, get caught in the first round. Nice little left hand there. I don't know if it takes him longer to feel out because he does have it does always have a good round. It's just always something. Oh, oh nice head oh. And once again, gets caught with that right hand. Pettigrew taking him down. And gets it done. Gets and it down. What do you know? <laughs> oh, look, I don't... <laughs> I don't want it to happen, but it's like it, it just seems in all of Jack Della's fights to go this way. Well, he's got 10 seconds he left always, in the first one. He always finds a way out of it. Do not get me wrong. He always finds a way out of it. But he just seems... And that ends round one. Jack Della feeling it now. See, that is the thing, though. Jack Della always seems to get caught with something. Right managed to, to survive and then the rest of the fight is, is however it likes to go. Let's have a look at the replay again we'll find that uh, both fighters had moments but uh, again Pettigrew landed with a yeah, few yeah. nice rights just down the pipe yeah. there's the right beautiful one too it's how Glenn Pettigrew is really closing the gap there that lead jab throw on the right hand Jack with the overhand he gets caught and this is where to take the left look that one two just to, to get himself in even tries a little bit of the, the slap hook. Jack Diller missing with the, the kick. And this takedown. It's sort of the thing I'm talking about. It's not a game changer, but it's just it's something Jack Diller doesn't want to happen. And he probably loses round one Second with that. Jab. Especially when Pettigrew's saying that he's going to put him to sleep in this one. So. Let me tell you what, though. He normally bounces back in around two. It's going to be a very interesting round, this one. Again, the, the main event so far living up to expectations. All of Perth have been looking forward to this one for a number of weeks ever since the fight got announced. Here it is, round two. Matt, Matt Wynn is your uh, referee for this one. Scheduled five, five minute rounds. A lot more action to come. Nice head kick. Once again, one, two. Bit of a two, one actually from, from Pettigrew to get in. Jack Della really looking more, feeling out Glenn Pettigrew where Glenn's leading with the jab, trying to make something happen. Fights like this is cardio can be king. Ooh, what happened then? Slip. Ooh, counter there by Pettigrew as Jack Della came in. Nice. Up the tent. Beautiful technique by Pettigrew. Nice head kick. Jack Della, nice guard. He was really liking that little slap hook to open it up. Get those hands up so you can rip it in. Lord, yes. Yeah. Nice bodies. Great exchanges here. That's a good shot by Della. Both like guys have had a bit of a slip in the middle of the, uh, the cage. Yeah, there's been a lot of fights on tonight. Mm. A lot of sweat in that sticker. Oh, body shots there by Della. Oh, yeah. and a nice attempt of an elbow, but just misses. Could have spelled trouble for Pettigrew if that landed. Oh, oh nice jab there. I think that was a bit of a slip there. He's hurt by oh, the body shot. It might, not be. it might not be. It might be a finish. Jack Yeller does know how to finish. When he smells blood, it normally is all over. Glenn Pettigrew is as tough as anything, though. He is he's the one. finisher. He's going in. His fight IQ is right up there. And he seems to be... Look, he is hurt, but he seems to have survived that storm. And Jack Yeller normally puts people away at that moment. Oh, body shot again! I think he's in no doubt. Very similar shot. Della retains his welterweight championship for eternal MMA. What a performance! What a comeback after round one. It is deja vu. It is Groundhog Day again. That is almost identical. Go 
North Carolina enjoying that. Very happy Ben Vickers in the ring. There. So ladies and gentlemen, our referee has called a stop to this contest at one minute and 54 seconds of round number two. Declaring your winner by TKO and Stow, the eternal MMA welterweight champion, Jack Della. Jack Della. So ladies and gentlemen, I'm here with N Still, the eternal welterweight champion, Jack Della, getting it done by a second round TKO. And before we get into uh, what the chants are about, give us your thoughts on the fight. Great fight, uh, thanks to Glenn for coming out and punching very hard, so respect to him. So of course, this was your second time sharing the cage with Glenn. Did you feel much difference to the first? No. <laughs> so of course, Jack, there's been a, a lot of talk in the lead up to this. I believe this now makes it eight wins in a row and perhaps more impressively, eight finishes in a row. You've been continuously turning back the best welterweights that this country has to offer. What can we expect from you next? I still think there's a couple of better welterweights in Australia than me, but I think I'm better than them, but I need to prove that I'm better than them. But if the UFC comes calling, I'll definitely say yes. Well, of course, they have the Perth card coming up, and I know there's a lot of people in this state that would love to see you, in this country that would love to see you on that card. Uh, before I let you go this evening, though, I'm sure there's a lot of people you'd like to thank. Just want to say thanks to my team and Surge Fitness Wanneroo for the altitude training. It definitely helps a lot, so thank you very much, guys. Have a good night, everyone. Drive home safely. Well, ladies and gentlemen, give it up for your winner and still welterweight champion, Jack Della.